Hello, before this video starts, I just want to address something quickly about the whole Papa, Copa, Koopa, Koopa King? Bowser? Law thing that YouTube is putting. Um, if you don't know what it is, I'll link a video explaining it down below. The whole thing now is that you have to uh, mark your channel as geared for children or not geared for children, and if you indirectly mark your videos or channel, you can get a big fine, and I don't get paid, my videos aren't monetized, I just do these for fun. I don't think people know that, but yeah, this is for fun. I don't get paid. Um, so I don't know if I'll be affected by this, but just to be safe, I don't want to get fined. Um, my videos already, like, they're horror-based, so I don't think I will get affected. But, I, but just to be safe, to make sure that they know that my videos are not care for children, I may... I might swear a little bit more in videos, like, I might, like, I censor everything, like, as of now, I censor most things, but I might not censor, like, shit, or bitch, I might have to say that, I won't be dropping F-bombs, but I might have to swear a little bit, just so I know for sure that I won't get in trouble, um, because I, I don't want to get fined. So yeah, there's that, so if I swear a little bit more, that's why, and I apologize, yeah, okay, let's get into the video. Hey everyone, I'm back again for 2019. Woo! Oh shit, don't fall, please. Happy holidays. Happy December 2019. It is another Christmas cooking with T Tiki Toby. The most anticipated video of the year. P probably not, but it's like, it's been a yearly thing. I've been doing this since 2017, so this is like, this is a big deal now. This is a series, okay? Also like my hat, yeah. Okay, and today's outfit, you know, not the usual. Um, th this was Jeff's idea, uh. All the j jingle ladies. Yeah, again, it was Jeff's idea. He was like, oh, because you're you're single, you're gonna have to wear this. Because I'm married to my knife. Yeah, little does he know, I'm s single by choice. Suck on that, a asshole. Anyway, so I want to cover this up. Because it's kind of embarrassing, but I showed you guys it. So, of course, we're wearing the I infamous... Tim's apron, of course, because it would not be Christmas cooking with Toby without it. Also, for my American followers, this is what bagged milk looks like. Probably a bad idea, but I made myself some iced coffee on impulse. Probably not a good idea, because I don't really know how to handle caffeine. But look, it's Leonardo. <laughs> So today, th this year, as we know, 2017, I decorated some e Eggo waffles. Last year I made cr Christmas pancakes because I couldn't find the waffle iron. But but this year, I'm not a dumbass because I actually found the waffle iron. It was here. I didn't realize. Anyway, so today, this year, 2019, we are g going to be making Christmas waffles for once and for all. Actual c Christmas waffles. Um... And I just want to put it out here, right here, right now. This ain't f fandom, Toby, okay? I I'm not obsessed with waffles. I like waffles. They're very good. Like, who doesn't like waffles? But I'm not obsessed, okay? I'm not like, uh, hey, Masky, oh, well, waffles, waffles, waffles. I'm, I'm, I'm not that Toby, okay? So don't get any bad ideas. Don't get the wrong ideas. That, that's, that's not who I am. I'm a badass, okay? Like last year, except we have much better audio. We don't have sh shitty audio this year. Six to six, seven. Bold of you to think that I'm gonna do six to seven pancakes. Yeah, we know how that went last year. I only was able to make three. Oh my god, look. There's a recipe on here for how to make waffles. Okay. Okay, I can do that. We talked about how Tim and Brian had pink stuff, right? Yeah. Last year I talked about how they weren't manly because they had pink stuff. Well, they said that um, it doesn't matter. And I'm like, I'm still gonna make fun of you guys. I, I don't give a shit. Okay, um, I love them, don't worry. Okay, um, uh, one and a half cups of cold water. Why does it have to be cold? Can I be rebellious and say like, 
I want to be rebellious and just do like warm water or something, but we don't want to mess this up. Because I've messed up one too many times. But this year I'm not messing up, so I'm going to actually like follow all the rules smartly. Uh, okay, one. Okay. Now they want us to get one egg. Oh no. We know, okay, so to just to talk about this quickly. Um, we all know that I have Tourette's, right? So I have Tourette's, so I move and I tick without me wanting to, okay? Like I, it's not controllable. So me c cracking eggs is never a good idea, okay? Like never. But we did it last year, sorta, kinda, not really. But but this year, I'm, I think I'm actually gonna try. I'm gonna tick and I'm like, I'm scared. <clears throat> You know, if I sing, I, I realize if I sing, I, I don't tick. Because I'm distracted. So we're going to sing. Have a holly jolly Christmas. And in case you didn't hear. Oh, bye jolly, have a holly jolly Christmas. This year, I did it. And I did not crack it. Oh my god, it worked. Now I'm going to tick like hell now, though. This year is going much better than last year and the year before. See, I'm actually like Gordon Ramsay would approve of me, okay? Like I'm actually good this year. Okay, and t two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Bold of you to think that I know where that is. Um, oh, shit, it's right here. It's right here, okay. Get a sip of, or a Ninja Turtle coffee. Ah, I feel energized. You know, every year that I do this, I just, I'm gonna get pro progressively better. So it's gonna turn out that like one year, I'm gonna be like on one of those cooking shows making this video, so. Ah, oh, shit. Look what we have again. The not manly stuff that Tim and Brian have. Not manly. As I'm wearing purple and pink, but. You know, I shouldn't judge. I just want to put it out there. If you're a guy, you can like whatever color you want. Um, uh, and be manly. You know, manliness doesn't even matter. I just, I make fun of Tim and Brian all the time. Because they, we make, we kind of like collectively make fun of each other. Okay. Okay, one. And two. Santa, I'm going to need you to move. Okay, Ah! Oh my god, why did it fall? No, don't fall. Please, don't fall. Okay. Do you see how much I've improved? Like, I actually know what the hell I'm doing. And I'm not like an amateur this year. Like, I'm like, look at me go! Look, look at me go! I'm like an actual talented chef. Guru being a proxy, Slenderman, I want to become a chef. Send me to culinary school. That's where I should be. Oh my god, you can hear my jingle bells going off. I hate you, Jeff. I, I'm J JK, I love you, but like this was not a good idea. Now it is time to make these Christmas waffles. Cause, Cause they're not right now. So last year, if you, you know, if you were an OG, you would know that I tried to make them red, but it didn't work. So they just turned pink and they had like a glob that was red, look at Scott's that. I wanted to make them green originally, actually, but I couldn't find green dye, and I couldn't find the red dye. So we're gonna be using sprinkles to dye them, which this could either work, or it could just completely, you know, screw up everything, but, but I guess we'll have to see, so. Uh. Okay. Oh! It actually worked. See? Oh my god, I'm a genius. Like I'm I'm actually a, a, a genius cuz it's just sugar so it just melts. I am a friggin' genius. Oh my god, I'm going to make Tim and Brian send me to culinary school. It's probably going to be like really really sh sugary now, but like who cares? These aren't um, no one's expecting for these to be good. I'm just I want them to like, you know, be progressively better every year, but like who expects these to actually be, be good? Besides, you guys aren't tasting them, so it doesn't really affect you. Just more, is this entertaining? That's what matters. Okay. We're gonna make it green like the Joker's hair.
All right. Oh my God, I'm like so impressed with myself. So now we are going to be putting them in the waffle iron. So, so let's hope that this works. Excuse me, Santa. Okay, now we close it. Ugh. Spilling, oh no. So I will come back, I will come back when these are pretty well ready and, and we'll see if I have to make adjustments. Um, the, the first attempt didn't work. Uh, round two? Yeah, um, if you don't work this time, I, I swear I'm going to cry. This is thicker this time, so I don't know if that's gonna make a difference. Like, I, I don't know. I think I put too much last time. So we'll see if this make, makes, makes a difference. I, I don't know. So I am returning with some great news for you guys. I have three Christmas waffles this year um, to work with. But, but the one, so I have one, they're like kind of on a thing. So the first one's really burnt. Second one, semi-burnt. But this one it is per perfect. So we're gonna be using this one. Okay, the rest, uh, I'll keep these two for Tim and Brian, just to show them that this year, my mess that I made at least comes with food. Okay, so decoration time. Last year I know that I skipped over the decoration because in 2017 I did, I, the whole video was about decorating, but, but this year you're getting a two-in-one combo, making the waffles and, and now decorating them. Let's get on to this. I'm I'm ready. I had all my coffee, so I'm like I'm, I'm pumped. Ah! We have the green sparkles which we use to to dye the waffles. We have red sprinkles. We have these red and green sprinkles. And the best part, we have the infamous yellow icing or sparkle gel. If you're an OG, you'll remember this is the shit that I used for the first Christmas waffles video. I covered the waffles with them and it made it gross. We're not going to be using it because I, I don't, I think it's probably expired. Because uh, th this is from 2017. Like from t two years ago. So I don't, I don't even know where the expiration date is on it. But, but I'm not trusting it. So we're not going to be using this, obviously. So like, we're not using that. But, but we're gonna be using this stuff. Um, I think I'm gonna get some butter as well because we're not using icing because this year I don't really want to ruin them. Now we are back to the low angles from the traumatic 2017 Christmas waffles video. Okay, so we're gonna get the butter because we need the sprinkles to stick onto something, right? Right. So we're gonna kind of just slather it on there. Let me try to see if I can get a better angle. We're gonna like, yeah, slather it on. And the good thing is that the waffles are not really hot anymore, so it won't melt at contact. Okay. Because we need something for the sparkles to stick to. And now, we're going to be getting the red sprinkles. God damn it. Okay. Sprinkle them all over. Not overkill, like, that one year, because, geez, I got flashbacks. Not good flashbacks. And now we are getting Z Green's sparkles. Ooh, they look so nice. Oh my god, I'm so proud of myself. And now finally we are getting these sparkles, also from the Christmas Waffles 2017. You know, even if these don't look good, they aesthetically look a lot more pleasing than that one year. Look how much I've matured. I am a matured cook. And now. I know I said that I like wasn't gonna use it, but um, we're gonna be using this to put around the plate to say Happy Holidays or Merry Christmas because um, we still need to get that nostalgia in. Yikes! But we're not gonna actually be using it, like, cause it's gross. So Merry, there we go. Yo, these are actually like I'm actually kind of proud of myself. Okay, let's get to a better angle. Okay, let's pose for the thumbnail this year. Oh, you can't even see. But see? 
Merry Christmas. We'll pose for the thumbnail. Okay. My God, Tim and Brian bought like three different eggnogs. Oh my God. Okay, we'll get this one. Okay. Jeez, I guess Tim really wanted to stock up on it. Okay, let's pour some eggy eggnog. I have not had any of this this year at all, actually. True story. In Canada, we have real syrup, not fake ones. As I say, the to as I say this, and Toby's not even Canadian; he's American. He's from Colorado. Jeez. Waiting at a character. Anyway, okay, so we're gonna. Okay, let's actually try this. A little bit anxious. Not gonna lie. Hope they're back good this year, not, you know, disappointment. Because this year, I actually tried, and this will be the taste test. This will be determine if I'm ready to go to culinary school or not. Guess who succeeded again? Me. T Toby Rogers has succeeded again. I did it. Two years in a row. I actually make good food. Now we'll put it down with eggnog. Yes. I, I don't care if wa waffles and pancakes are easy to make. I, I succeeded and you guys are just jealous. Hell yeah. I'm proud of myself. Yes! Yes, I did it! And the mess was worth it. Yes! I did it! I did it! I did it! Mm, yeah, I screwed you, Jeff, who said I couldn't do it this year. I did it! I did it! I did it! Oh, woo, woo, woo! I did it! I did it! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! I, I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! No, 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 no. What happens when I have caffeine? I I'm gonna be talking faster than J James Charles. A anyway, th thank you for tuning in to t uh, Christmas Cooking with Tiki Toby Part 3. This has been going on for three years now. And am I happy? Yes, I am. So this has been a good series. And you wanna know what? I was even not even considering doing this video because I was worried it would get repetitive, but people were wanting me to do it again. So I was really happy to come back and have a successful meal this time in Tim's infamous apron. Yeah, I'm happy. And I hope that you guys are happy too. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And yeah, stay tuned for the next Christmas videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.